And we're live. What's going on, everyone? It's been a second since we've seen everyone. Good but to see you. We're here, and we're going to announce the winners of our latest giveaway, which is um, the 2021 New Year's giveaway. Yes. A lot of big prizes. <laughs> lots of big stuff yes, that we're giving away. So we're just going to wait for um, – we're supposed to we're – on, we're on a little bit early. We're supposed to be here at 3 o'clock. So we're going to wait for some – a little bit more people to show up before we announce anyone. Uh, meanwhile, let's let's answer some people. Let's yeah. see what everyone's been up to. You want to introduce yourself in the chat? Introduce um, yourself in the chat. Um, and I've got a question for you guys. What kind of fishing do you like? Um, where do you primarily fish? What do you like to catch? Let's hear it. Uh, we're a community that is just full of so many different kinds of people. We're, we're a global, we're a global company. We're a global community here. And um, what is really interesting to me is all the different kinds of fish that we all target around the world and how we can all pretty much connect based on that. Uh, that alone is, is really awesome. The power of community from fishing is, is, uh, is a very lucky thing that we have right now. Yeah, it's like no matter where you're from, we all speak the same language, which is fishing. Which right? is, we all love fishing. It doesn't matter your political background or where you're from or what language you speak. We all love fishing here. Yeah. And that's all that really matters <laughs> right now. So that's that's why we're gathering in the name of fishing. Yes. So let's hear it, guys. Where Where is everyone Hi. from? We're so happy that you're here. I'm so happy that you're here. I'm just going to say it. Okay, so Ki Yang. My name is Ki Yang, and I want to fish with you when you come back to North Carolina. We love fishing in North Carolina. The beaches of North Carolina is now, like, one of our favorite places to fish. And you guys might have seen that, like, the past maybe, like, five, six, seven videos has been in, in North Carolina. Um, More than that, possibly been like a, like a season of fishing there. an entire season we did the whole fall season in in north carolina and i don't regret a second of it that was <laughs> i should have gotten there sooner Your regrets yeah i can't believe it took us this long right it's because we <laughs> needed the truck we didn't have the truck to drive out on the beach so we were like eh, it's not really we would rather fish in florida there's more public spaces to fish in north carolina a lot of the spots you kind of need four by four driving um and we just recently got ourselves a, a toyota tundra and decked it out so that we can actually sleep on the beach. Uh, we did a whole season of that, and that was really fantastic. Right. Um, comment below. Comment here. I want to hear from you guys. What do you guys think of the New Carolina uh, fishing expeditions and the fishing journeys? Do you guys like from the Houston Galveston Ooh, area? That was where we were about to go. Yeah, like um, we were about to. We had a trip planned to to <laughs> Texas. We had a trip planned to Texas, but we had to cancel it Last because of COVID. Year, yeah. yeah. But that was what we were supposed to be doing. But instead, we went to North Carolina, and uh, that worked out just fine. I want to say hi to R12 Gaming from Jamaica. I want to say hi to McFadden Brother Fishing from Ohio. To Mark Bartholomew from England, Yorkshire. Wow. We've got people all over. All fishing. Hi to Andy from LA, Southern California, surf fishing. Mm -hmm. From New Jersey, from Florida, Georgia, from Hawaii, from Portugal, from California, from San Francisco. Morocco. Wow. And we all love sea fishing here. Are we, are we all primarily sea fishermen or are we a little bit of both? Are we primarily um, freshwater fishermen? Let's hear it, guys. <clears throat> Hi to William from South Africa. Hello to Norway. Oh, my goodness. Oh, someone from Maryland. Cole. Shout out to Cole. So we are from Maryland in the United States. We're currently in Maryland. Currently in Maryland. In our videos, it looks like we are in North Carolina or, or Florida. Florida. Or uh, <laughs> Papa Lou, Papa what's going on? What's going on? on it's been a long time. How have you been, Papa Lou? Was it two years ago that we saw him? So we met Papa Lou in um on in a fishing convention we did last year, and I think it was two New Jersey. Ago. Was it New Jersey? I, I think, think so. it was New Jersey. Uh, here's Papa Lou again, New Jersey. Yeah, he was from. We were we, were, we met him in New Jersey. Yes. Um, and he was one of. It was just so nice to have so many people come out and support. And Papa Lou was one of our big supporters. And yes. I remember. Miss you, miss you too, Papa Lou. Maybe when a lot of people here from South Africa as well. When uh, COVID's over, we will we'll do more shows, and we'll probably see you again if you end up coming to the the show. Right. Um. So, in terms of what we've been doing. Yeah, we have been so we 
got back from North Carolina a while ago. We've been back from North Carolina for back. like, m I think a month now, two yeah. months now. But those videos will continue to come out. We filmed <laughs> so much awesome content there that like right now what we're focusing on is finding new fresh content. We don't expect to do another whole season in North Carolina this next upcoming season. We're actually going to be doing it in Florida. Yes. So we're going to be traveling to this like Skyway Pier area. We're going to be fishing on the Jacksonville beaches. Um, maybe go down a little bit further south to like uh, Melbourne area. Um, but this time we're really going to be targeting um, the Skyway Pier. Ooh. That's going to be our new spot for, for this upcoming spot. spring. Yeah, we actually just got, we just returned back to Maryland from Florida. We spent the holidays there with your parents, mm -hmm. um, fishing around a little bit, not like too much, but we have some fun videos coming out. Big, oh, Joe. Big Joe! Thank you. Thank you. Anyone who's donating to us is not necessary, but thank you from the bottom of our hearts. This money goes right back into the channel, right back to us. Keep providing you more great content and every penny is appreciated. Um, thank you so much. What did he say? What do you think about the Catch the Fever Striper Stealth Rods? I have not heard that, but thank you for letting me know about that. I'm going to actually look into that and um, I, I'll get back to you. I might make a review on it or um, if you're on Instagram, message me about it on Instagram and I'll get back to you about that as well. Yes. And for those of you who have messaged us on Instagram and we haven't gotten back to you, we're working, we're on, working it. on it. There's, <laughs> there's a lot of people who ask us questions and we spend maybe an hour or two uh, every once in a while to try and actually answer all of those, but it's just a lot to answer. Um, so just be patient. We're doing our best. If I don't answer you on Instagram, try emailing us as well, uh, because there's like three different folders on Instagram. It's getting kind of confusing now. So email <laughs> us at um, info at heyskipperfishing.com, um, and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, yes. Um I want to give a quick shout out to Exotic Guardian 329 who just caught a 38 inch bull red the other day. Nice. Good on yes, you. That's fun. Okay. Do you want to talk about this giveaway? Do you want to talk about the what's going on here? Well, sure. First of all, let's let's do a quick giveaway right now. This is not just the winners of the giveaway that we just did. We're doing a brand new giveaway right now this for something second. quick, right? So these stickers right here. I've got a bunch of these stickers that I created. Mm -hmm. This one is Red Drum, and they're they're targeting a crab down here. And this is a, kind of like a reminder, like, Red Drum love crabs. And I love Red Drum. <laughs> Flounders, they love shrimp. This is our logo here. This is a uh, mandala. mandala that my sister made. And then this is trout that are chasing little peanut bunkers and shrimp because that's what they love to eat. So I made these stickers. Um, and I'm going to be giving away like a set of these stickers to 10 people right now, right this second. 10 people. All you need to do is um, in the link in the description, we have a newsletter. If you sign up for the newsletter, we'll be telling, we'll be sending you uh, emails about like the upcoming sales, upcoming giveaways um, and other upcoming new products and stuff like that. Um, but if you if you go ahead and register right now for um, the free newsletter, we will we will pick the top ten people, yes. and we'll just email you right after this stream and say, hey, we're going to send you some stickers. Um, but we're going to be sending you the variety pack of stickers that we have right here. Yep. I mean, we sell these on our store as well. So anyone else who wants to help support, like you guys who donated five dollars. I definitely want to just send you this right now. So Papa Lou and, and the other guy who sent us five bucks, please um, send me your information and I'm going to send you a five packs of stickers right now. Oh, we just got another one from North Carolina Saltwater Weekly. Wow. Another thank what? You. Donation up at the top. Really? I it in the, in the chat, but thank you. What do they say? I don't know. I just saw their name in $5. So oh, well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. If you're donating to us right now, Please send us an email. We're going to be sending you stickers right now. But anyone else who, who wants to just win this right now, just, do it like real quick. <laughs> just us your email in, in the, the newsletter, a link in the description below, and um, we're going to send you some stickers right now. Okay, Nathan is saying there's plenty of good fishing in South Texas, Saint, Saint, South Padre Island, Port, Port Mansmouth. Mansmith. We're going. Oh, we're going. Maybe this fall. Maybe this <laughs> fall. But it was hard to do it last spring because Corona just came out. And right after Corona, like 
we didn't really know what was going on. So we traveled nowhere. Um, actually, I haven't been sick for the past yeah. over a year, <laughs> over a year now. And let me tell you, it feels fantastic to be able to, uh, to not get sick and have to wait an entire week to, to get better. I want to say thank you to Brad Samora who just gave us five dollars. He says, "Oh my so gosh, thank you, thank you for your support. Thank, thank you guys all so much for being here and watching." Seriously, I mean, a donation is really is not necessary. Just the fact that you. But the fact that you are donating still, it just means so much to us that like you want to support us because you like our cause. We want to help you guys get on fish and we want to help the rest of the world get on fish in a responsible way, right? We're a responsible, sustainable way. And I think a lot of, a lot of things with going on with, with YouTube right now is like, there's a lot of people fishing on there, but they're not necessarily teaching people how to fish in a way where it's okay for our earth and it's not hurting our earth. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for, for, for being here with us right now. Um, and like I said, one more time, if you guys want to win a pack of our stickers right now, um, just enter your email into our newsletter sign up. We'll be emailing you about new giveaways, new, new sales, new products that we're coming out with. Um, anytime we come out with a new sticker, which is pretty much once every month, um, we'll be picking 10 winners and just sending you guys stickers right away yep. and if you've already donated right now please send us an email or see, send us an instagram dm and i'm going to send you a pack of five of these right now email is info at, at hey skipper fishing dot com there you go the okay so you want to get into some some prizes i do but i also just want to say like there are a lot of people in the chat who are saying how much we've helped them and like, first of all, thank you. Like that, that really makes us feel like what we're doing hats is off worthwhile. To you. I'm like, oh, hats off. My hair is so bad. Um, the Haiku King. The haiku King. When are you going to collab with? Extreme Philly Fishing. Fishing. I don't it know. We should soon. I mean, like we're, we're, we're connected. Yeah. He's not too far from us either. Yeah. That would, let me reach out to him. We, we talk to each other once in a while, but we have not been able to figure out um, scheduling um, he doesn't necessarily like to target the same thing we like to target and vice versa, but I'm sure that we can find, we can find, find something together. We're going to find yeah. something together. Yes. But, um, yeah. Okay. And I'll, to everyone from Texas, like we're going, <laughs> there's so many people who are like, come to oh Texas. Oh my gosh. I, that's what everyone was saying. <laughs> North Carolina. Next, we got to do that with Texas. Next, but we also get a lot of people saying go to the Skyway Pier. Yes. So that's what we're doing this yes. spring. We're gonna go to the Skyway Pier, um, and uh, maybe one time, maybe one year we'll go to like some somewhere crazy like South Africa. Yeah, I know. I really want to do South Africa because like, a lot of people list. ask us about South Whoa, Africa. My oh my gosh! Okay, first, first, Ruben Porus. Thank you for two dollars. That's so awesome. Thank you, Ruben. He asks, "Is the Phoenix Saltwater Travel Rod worth it?" I haven't tried the Phoenix Travel Rod. Um, but I have tried all like a lot of their surf rods and from what I, from what I've used with the surf rods the past four seasons, I love them. They're a great price and they feel awesome. They're nice and light and they're very strong. I've brought in lots and lots of fish. And your inshore, you had an inshore as well that you were using for a little bit. We used, yeah, I used the Phoenix inshore as well. That worked out really well. So I do think that given the track record of Phoenix rods, the saltwater travel rod will probably be worth it. Yeah. Um, next is Dominique Munoz. Thank okay. you. He says, come fish in South Texas. Corpus, Corpus Christi. Christi. I would love to. I know. It's like I would love to. We were trying to. Like, what are some, go. who are some YouTubers that we should meet up with that are like, like uh, Texas based? Comment oh some below because I, I want to, oh my gosh. I know. We have to talk to Craig now. I lost him. Oh, Craig Harkness. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. He just gave us $20. Oh, my gosh. That is so kind. He said, keep it going. Absolutely love your videos. Your videos have helped me so much. Come visit LBI sometime. That is so awesome. And and Thanks. thank you so much for the donation. That I don't think we, we never get this many <laughs> donations. I'm, but thank you, guys. It, it's, I don't know what to say. It's really, it feels really good to me because – my goal the past two years, three years is to just help as many fishermen as possible, like help as many people get people, into fishing yeah. because there's so many questions. There's so many things that, 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 that come with fishing that like aren't answered that people don't want to talk about. They want to keep it a secret. 
and they want to keep it a secret because they don't want people to catch their fish. But for me, it's like fishing's for everyone. No one is born knowing how to fish. Hmm. You got to learn at some point. And I want to be the person to help you learn. Um, it's just been a great way for me to connect with, with Aaron, a great way with me to connect with my family, with friends, with random strangers from across the world. Yeah. Like I can travel anywhere and, and talk to anyone about fishing. Because if you know about fishing, you know about fishing. <laughs> and it seems like everyone in this chat room is part of the club. We're in the club. We're definitely in a club. So I want to say thank you to all of you guys. Because without you guys, I would have no, no real mission here. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I feel like this is a, a purpose of mine is to, is to be able to connect with you guys and help as many people learn how to fish in, in a way where the world will thank us for it. Yeah, I hope so. And That's uh, the goal. thank you guys for giving us purpose. Yes. <laughs> so that leads that leads perfectly into we want to give things to you. <laughs> we love you. We appreciate you. We want to give things to you. Wearing First bra. <laughs> oh, I'll give them a new one. But they're really comfortable. I know they are. They're really soft. This patch is huge and it feels really nice. It's not some cheap hat. We decided we're not doing anything, any more like stuff that – we don't a hundred percent stand by. Um, that includes sponsors. That includes our own products. Yes. Um, we we have tested these hats for a while prior to even letting it out, making sure that this is the right quality. Uh, because honestly, our fans, our subscribers, y'all deserve the best, the best of the best. Not some you know cheap out thing that I, I you know think is going to be uh, really cheap for us, right? And really cheap for you. If you're going to buy something, make sure you're going to like it. Make sure it's going to last you. And uh, that's why all of our products and all the products that we stand behind, Deeper, our, our bait boxes, our bait, our hats, everything about our, our um, Hey Skipper is is about Tried and tested. good quality. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Um, and I think you touched on it before, but like even with sponsors, like we really don't take sponsorships. Mm -mm. Um, the only sponsor that we've been working with is Deeper, who we're kind enough to donate this to this giveaway. Because we can stand by them. Yeah, exactly. Um, believe me, we get hundreds and hundreds of offers for people sending us free stuff if we just put it on our show. Um, yeah, from it like just China or like wherever. Or from wherever, yeah. just random people sending us a bunch of stuff always wanting us to put it on our site, always wanting us to, to show you guys like, like these new products. But honestly, it's worth it to me to make sure I love this product before I share it with anyone. Yeah. I, the worst thing that can happen is I put it on the show. I don't like it that much. And then people buy it and they don't like it. And they say, why'd you even recommend it? We don't do that. So we don't do that kind of thing. <laughs> we don't do We that. really try out our products and we really extensively test them prior to putting it on here because we don't want it to be like, we don't want to lie to you guys. We don't want to make it seem like we only talk about things that we trust and that we use basically. Yes. Yes. And like that's it. <laughs> and in that, I hope you guys can trust my opinion and just trust my recommendation uh, because we do take a lot of time in, in making sure that the products that we share with you guys are, are worth it. Yeah. Agreed. And without further ado, but I think that leads us into the things that we're giving away. Oh, the sinker guy's here. What's up? Chip. Chip's here. What's up? Chip. His sinkers are top notch. Yeah, we, Those we have been on the show. We <laughs> yeah, we put on his sinkers on our show because we really believe that his sinkers are I mean uh, they're the best. That's the that's yeah. the only Sputniks <laughs> that I get because they're they're good and yeah. they're they're made with quality. Uh they're a little bit more expensive, but they're they're like when you hold them, you know it's good. Um it, it they're called the sinker guy sinkers. Um, it's worth it. Good. Yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Again, we're giving away 10 of these. So, so we're giving away stickers to, I love these, by to the, way. the next 10 people who sign up to our newsletter. So or... that's that. Okay. So let's go to the fourth place prize of our last, our latest giveaway. All right. Fourth place is going to be one of these beautiful sticker variety packs. And a shrimpy starter kit. This is our shrimpy starter kit. Comes with two packs of our shrimpy bits in here. And each of these come with maybe 25 to 30 shrimp. Mm -hmm. And they're like little shrimps like this, but they work perfectly if you're beach fishing and you're tipping it with like fresh bait as well. These right. things work great. Or if you're going for like bait fish and you mm -hmm. want to just put a little bit on a sabiki rig, you can catch a, sh a crap load of bait mm -hmm. 
<laughs> and then live line that bait out. Right. Yeah. I mean, I would think whiting. I'm thinking panfish. I'm thinking things with smaller mouths, right? Yep. Um, and it comes in this hard case right here. This is the mini case right here. But it's waterproof. You can put it to your belt. And, uh, and yeah, these are... It's a beautiful bait, honestly. It is. Okay, so this is the fourth place prize. Fourth and third. The They're third the and fourth place prize. Yes. Um, and so you want to explain how the, the winners... Okay, so we already winners. picked the winners. Um, and we did this with a random number picker. Right. Okay, so we had about 4,000 people enter this competition. Wow. Um, and we just randomly picked a number. Yeah, I like put it, there's like a Google like number generator. And I put in from one to almost 4,000. And uh, we let Google pick the winners. And uh, I wrote down their names. And now I'm going to read them to you. So you can okay. be one of these winners. Who knows? No one's been contacted yet. Okay, so no one has been contacted yet. So so take this with a grain of salt. Whoever does win, the, the winners that we announce, they could not answer us. And then we pick again. Right. So make sure you keep checking your email. Check your email. Um, in fact, one of the winners that we picked unsubscribed from the emails. So we had to pick a new person right. because... If we were to email them, they wouldn't get the win. They wouldn't get the announcement that they won. So make sure you stay subscribed so that you'll know you're the winner. Right. I um, feel sorry for the guy who who unsubscribed because he won the grand prize and then I don't he he unsubscribed. So how am I supposed to send him an email about it? That's things. But, sorry. So check your email. Um, if you win, you have I think three days to email us back basically. And if we don't hear from the winners within three days. We'll pick another person. Yeah. So, Aaron, you know that hat looks pretty good on you. I thank you. I think it, you haven't worn it yet. What do you mean? I've worn it on the shows much. and stuff. Oh. Just in Florida, I just wore it. To it party. looks good. We should wear. You should wear that more often. Thanks. <laughs> um. So. Okay. So third place. <laughs> Let's hear it, Aaron. This is fourth place. Fourth place. Fourth, fourth place. place. Fourth place. Christine Hooks. Christine Hooks. Christine Hooks with a K. Christine with a K. Hooks. Christine Hooks. Congratulations, Christine. Okay, that's just. Oh, Gus is here. What's up, Gus? Hey, Gus. Hey, Gus. If you if you just send me an, an Instagram DM, I'm gonna I'll send you some bait. Gus sent us um some some big shark rigs before. Oh yeah. And, and I, still I still have it right now. I haven't used it. Shark fishing together. Maybe this year. Gus sent us um some. Some big shark rigs before. Oh yeah, and, and I, still I still have it right now. I haven't used it. Shark fishing together, maybe this year or or an email, and I'm gonna send you some tomorrow. Cool. All right. Okay. So fourth place, Christine Hooks. Yay. Third place. Third place. Wait, this is the same prize. I didn't pull out two though. Okay. It's like the same thing, because this goes with the okay. Brand prize. Okay. Okay. So the next, the next one. Third place. Third, Third place. place. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Daniel Stutes. Daniel Stutes. 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 Daniel Stutes. Daniel Stutes. Okay, cool. We will be emailing you later, um, and we hope that you claim your prize. Oh, Mike is here. Mike, who? From me, just fishing. Oh, hey, Mike. <laughs> he's from our. He's from our neck of the woods. What's going on, Mike? Hi, it's cold today. It's a very cold winter here. It is a cold. We're in the dog days of winter over here. Yep. It is cold. But spring, spring's around the corner. Spring is around the corner, and we're all ready. All right. So I want to talk about the next prize, which is second place. Second place. Prize. No, not this. Well, I guess you could do that. Okay. <laughs> this one's second favorite. place comes with this big box. Right. This is my favorite box. This yes. thing is massive. It can hold, like, I think up to, like, six packs of our bait in here. Yes. Like, it's a lot of bait. So it comes with an ultimate starter kit, which is a squid, tentacles, squid, slab, and shrimp combo. Hi, Drone Phoenix. Thank you for the donation. He says, hey, from Malta. Remember your honeymoon place? Yeah, I do remember. Last time we were live. Yeah. <laughs> I love catching garfish. Sometimes I just don't want to bite. Any tips to be more successful? I hear that gar, it, it's it's tricky to catch, but what you use is a piece of like that that rope. 
Oh, right. And it gets yeah. stuck in there. It's stuck in their, in their the teeth. teeth and you bring it in like that because it's really hard to set a hook on a gar because their mouths are so hard. Mm -hmm. So my suggestion is, and by, I'm no, by, by, by no means a gar expert, but what I've seen is use a piece of string on the back, a piece of rope. That's true. Yeah. We also were catching like some pretty crazy hound fish last time we were in Mexico. Mm -hmm. You remember? Yeah. Those were like four, four feet they hound fish. Big. Um, and we were catching them on Bucktails. Yep, bucktails with our squid <laughs> with the on the squid, end. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so the squid is actually like a great trailer for your bucktail. I okay, would like so second place, it comes with uh, both packs of squid. Yes, and a shrimp in there. And a shrimp. There's a shrimp that goes in here. And mm -hmm. I'm actually going to throw some of our clammy bits in too. Oh my goodness. This, this is our new clammy bits that, that just got released. I, I just made this new sticker for it as well. Um, it comes with like I think nine clams in there, but they are they're the bomb, y'all. They, they look just like this. So they're the bomb. They're not normal clams. They're they're very special clams from Canada, and they're naturally colored this red color right here. Um, and this red color, that flash of red and the smell of the clam, gorgeous. It just attracts so many freaking fish. Just gorgeous. It's a very good bait. So we're going to be including this into the giveaway as well. Yeah. And I actually wanted to say thank you to anyone who has already got one of these bags of clams. Um, we just put these stickers on. So maybe you didn't even get a bag with a sticker on it. And that's cool because you're super early. But thanks. Um, and thanks to anyone who has, has supported support us and buying oh, yeah. into our bait and whatnot. Everyone reporting back with all the fish that you've been catching has been amazing. It. it is so crazy to see how these baits work all over the different parts of America. And please keep sending us pictures. It's really awesome to see that this is working. Tyler Zang said, when I used your clam bait, I got my record yellowtail. Whoa. <laughs> yes. I so love it. comment below. Have you used our bait before? And what kind of stuff have you caught before? Cool. Um, okay, so to continue with this second prize, we have this big, special, beautiful, ultimate starter kit. In addition, we've got this shrimpy starter kit, two beautiful bait boxes. It comes with one of our new beanies. Which looks really awesome on you, Aaron. I already said that, <laughs> said that, but I appreciate it. And it comes with a sticker variety pack. Boom. Yep. Very exciting. That's a lot of bait. I gotta say, like that's a lot of that's bait. a lot of bait. Like and that's like three months of bait. Yeah, <laughs> depending. I mean, where's my, so. Where's my bait box? I think I it's right there. This is the one I always bring out. A um, more busted. You know, I've been using this for like a year now. Look. Okay, so it rusted a little bit here, but it totally still works. This thing lasts it's forever. Only like full of salt. <laughs> and it's all fresh. I like how the it's first still fresh. Thing you do is smell it. Because I want to make sure it didn't go bad, but this bait doesn't go bad. Look, I've, I've got um, tentacles, clams that are already cut in half in here. It's filled with our special salt mixture. And um, like I said, I've been using this thing for like a year now, like the same box. Um, and it works really well. My my other my other shrimpy bits box. I met a subscriber in Jacksonville, mm -hmm. just some random dude. Oh yeah, he came up to me and he, he was like, "I love your show so much." And we were just like talking, like he was just there. We were just talking, and his wife comes up and says, "You know, it's actually it's actually his birthday today." <laughs> so I ended up giving him my old my old thing of uh, shrimpy bits and a, and a bunch of bait in there as well. Really made his day, and uh, it just good. felt good. Yeah. It just felt really good that that like one that he knew our show. And that too, now I, I let him try some of the bait that I really love. Yeah, I hope he liked it. Hi from Jacksonville. Amazing fishing up the Henry, Henry Grady, Grady Bridge. Bridge. Yeah. Huge assortment of fish. Good vibes. We love Jacksonville. We love Jacksonville so much so that we're probably going to move there. Yep. Hopefully by the end of this summer. Um, but we are looking into uh, getting a place there and, and starting – our, our, you know, next part of our lives there together. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> Random announcement. Random <laughs> announcement. Yeah. Um, we're definitely thinking about moving to Florida. Um, 
it's yeah. gonna be fun. It's a big change. It's a lot to figure out, but that's ultimately what we want to do. So. But I think it'll be great because then we can continually make so much content. Yeah. And from from Jacksonville, we can drive to like right. we can drive to like the Everglades. We can drive to like the Keys. We can drive westwards. I mean, Alabama, to Louisiana, like, Texas. Yes, yes. And it's not going to be a forty-hour drive. It's going to be a, a much quicker drive. Right. Um, so we're going to be able to make way more content and explore way more. We're going to be like real Southerners. Mike, we're not leaving. We're going to be <laughs> back and forth a lot. My whole family's here. So we're not, there's, we're not going to leave Maryland. We're, um, we're planning to just go to Florida for, you know, five years and just have a good time for a little bit, come back. And then, you know, we still have a lot of family here. Oh, I want to see, hold on. He said, read my donation. Dominguez, Munas. He says, would love for y'all to fish with Thresher fishing. He will put you on big bull reds from the jetty. Ooh, that's, a great idea. that's not a bad idea. Also, can you tell him that? Because you yeah, know. tell Thresher too. <laughs> tell him. <laughs> like, if you guys want to see us um, fish with other YouTubers, let us know, and also let the other party know as well. We need people to like talk about this, otherwise yeah. they might not <laughs> like care. Who knows? Um, Okay, I want to announce the second place. The second place winner. Let's I would like let's to get on. It. Okay. Get on with it. Yep. Okay. Drum roll, please. Second place. Robert Wood. Robert, Robert Wood. Wood. He Robert, would win. He would. Wood. W O D. W O O D. Robert. Wood. Robert Wood. If you're here, congratulations. Say, well, congratulations first of all. But if you're here, say here. <laughs> no one will ever see that oh my gosh someone's like glitching our chat okay everyone wants to see us fish with thresher yes barbara says my husband would go fishing every day if he could <laughs> so would i, I believe so it. would i, I but i gotta it. work <laughs> <laughs> got to do some work. <laughs> People think that all, like, like all I do is just fish nonstop. That's true. That's that's a very common belief. But I do a lot of work here on the other end too. Well, like ed between editing and and creating our products and writing PDFs and you know yeah. dealing with customer service and shipping out stuff. It's shipping like shipping is like a big a big part of it. Here know? here's what actually happens. I go fishing for maybe a week straight. Yeah. That week, I get maybe five or six episodes out of it. That will last me six weeks of content. I only fish one that that one week. One the rest, six weeks. <laughs> the rest of the time, I'm working on on <laughs> publishing it, on on actually creating our bait, on shipping out bait, on talking to you guys, responding to you guys. Um, but it's not. It's not. I'm not fishing nonstop. Oh my gosh, we got a, a from Brazil. From Brazil, hello, Clayton. Okay, Pesto you translate that real quick. Translate that on Google. Okay, okay, I want to know what that I will, means. I will. And when, for those of you who don't speak English and comment in other languages, we we look. So don't not comment because you don't think I will understand what you're saying. I look up what that means, and I'm actually kind of embarrassed that I don't speak more than three languages here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, people should know more languages. People should know more languages, like. To be able to talk with the rest of the world, you should know more languages. It shouldn't be just like, right. I can kind of speak Spanish. I can speak Chinese. I can speak English. I wish I could speak all the other languages so I can teach everyone in a different language. That would be so awesome. He said, fishing is my passion. Fishing is my passion. That's what he said. Pescar y minha. I can't pronounce well, that. Well, thank you, Clayton. Thank you, Clayton. Thank you. Um... Yeah, I was, we, 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 you were just talking about our workload and it made me think that I wanted to talk about how we make all this bait, like just you and me, <laughs> you know? Yeah. Like, I'm not sure if like anyone knows that. I maybe, mean, maybe, maybe some people is, think but... that we, we have like a big factory or something where like, where like a bunch of people are making us this bait and we don't do it anything with it right. but we i literally like, my hands touch every single every piece of bait that go that goes through our refrigerator that goes right to you guys right um and i know during the holiday seasons when when shipping was kind of crazy during usps time we hand we hand delivered every single package to the usps and a lot of them got lost because of usps 
I would, I would say a few of them, like a, a, an amount of them, not all of them. No, but people thought it was because of we weren't shipping it, but that's not true. Like it was it, one of my top priorities to make sure everyone got their stuff prior to Christmas. Yeah. Um, but we do a lot of stuff pro besides just fishing. We, we, yes. we have to put together a lot of stuff to, to really be able to teach you guys in the way where it's, it's digestible, mm -hmm. easy to learn and really fun and easy to just keep watching. Yeah. And that's not easy to create. We take a lot of time and we take a lot of pride in, in our products and, and in the, in our in actual show. content yeah. that we put out. Yeah. Um, and sometimes we film episodes that we don't even publish because we're like, they deserve better than this one. They deserve, we, I don't want to put this out because I want the best content for them. Oh, Christopher. Christopher. Hi. Thank deer you. Deer meat for dinner. I've you heard of them. Deer meat for dinner. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. I would definitely do that. I would absolutely do it. Outdoor chef life. Yeah. We watch him too. Yep. Sometimes I see on, on Instagram. Yep. He just got a van. He's going to travel in is what I saw. Mike says that we need to learn how to speak, uh, speak Spanish better. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> at least i could read that <laughs> yes hey mason is not too late to enter actually we are actually giving away we're doing a quick giveaway right now if you want to uh win a pack of our stickers right here um just enter in the description below there's a a newsletter right this newsletter when you sign up for it we're going to be picking we're going to be picking winners from that to that we're going to send stickers right away. And anyone who has sent us uh, any kind of donation, as long as you're in the uh, U.S., we're going to be sending you a, this same variety pack right here. Yes. If you donated anything to us today, just message us on um, Instagram or our email, and we're going to send you a pack of, of stickers right away. Yes. Tomorrow is shipping day. so It is. Um. Yeah. Okay. okay. Ready for first place? I am ready. Okay. Let's talk about first place. First place is crazy. Let's talk about this. The this deeper. is like its own. It could be its own prize, honestly. It like could it, be. It's it's a really incredible But we wanted to give them more. Piece of technology here. Oh, here's Andreas. Oh, Andreas. Herrera. I used some of your rigs when I was out catching 10 pound bonitos the other day. 38 of us on a boat caught nearly 400 fish. Come to Cali Whoa. someday. That's that so, so crazy. Awesome. Good for Thank you, man. Some of our rigs. That is so awesome. That's really awesome. Thank you. Oh, and by the way, guys, I have a, a little announcement. So whoever's on this, you're going to be the first to ever know this. I don't know what you're about to announce. Go ahead. About the rigs. Oh, oh, oh. oh. We, we are working together with a uh, really cool company right now that um, I've been using and, and looking at his stuff for a while um, to make us some really cool fishing rigs yes. um, that we can put onto our website. So you guys don't have to tie it. If you don't, if you don't have time to tie it, you guys can pick up some of these hand tied rigs um, that we're, we've custom collaborated with him to, to make it, make sure that it's the personal hay skipper rig for us. Um, yeah, I do. We do. Hold on. It's, <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. I don't know where it went. Anyways, we're coming up with our own custom rig that we're going to be putting out for whoever wants to try it. I know a lot of people, they, they like to tie it, but other people like to buy it. Right. Because that's they just true. don't have time. That's true. And that same goes for their bait. You know, if you don't have time to go buy live bait, then just definitely just have a pack of our bait in, in, in your backpack yeah. and you don't have to go to the bait shop. I'm very excited about it. It'll be with S and J Pompano rigs. S and J Pompano rigs. Interested. They make the coolest floats I've ever seen. Uh, it's going to be a really cool rig. It, I mean, like these rigs are like nothing I've ever seen before. Like they're, they're really, gorgeous. really great quality. So I'm really excited for you guys to uh, to see what this is. And if you want to be the first to know that that when I'm when they come out. Um, because we're only going to have a very limited amount. You should sign up for our newsletter right now because we're going to be announcing it there first. And the first, however many people is first come first serve to these rigs. So if you're interested in doing something like that, um, interested in trying that sign up for the newsletter. <laughs> I like everyone's like guess about what you're going to announce. Are you pregnant? No. Everyone's like guess about what you're going to announce. Are you pregnant? No. Did you guys get married? <laughs> no. That's what <laughs> everyone all. I was like, I think I lost my invitation to the wedding in the mail. <laughs> no invitations. We set. have not even planned out 
um, any kind of wedding yet. Okay. Simply because yeah. it's COVID and it's hard to get people to gather right now. We um, want to be there, you know. And we're just gonna relax and enjoy our our engagement together because uh, you know we're young. We're we're in a good place right now. Um, and we've got this company and, and it's fun <laughs> and it's fun. So we're going to wait off on any kind of wedding plans until after COVID. Um, and then everyone is invited. Yes. <laughs> everyone here is going to be invited. We, we might do like a big live stream or something. I don't know. Mm. It would, it would be That'd nice be for everyone to be able to see us. Yeah. Okay. I want to say thank you to Serfuse. Serfuse. Zero five two two. Thank you for all your teachings. Look forward to your videos every week. Thank you for your support. I look forward to talking to you every it, week. It's so conference. nice that like <laughs> that we can actually teach people. But like our show is not just for people who who want to learn, but just people who want to chill and and watch a fun show. Thank you to Real Her Hir Hiram. Hiram G. Thank you. Thank you. I recognize that name. And Coastal Carolina Outdoors. Wow. Hey, what's up? We're getting Thanks. a lot of donations, y'all. Thank you. And Ruben Porus again just, just purchased, purchased one, one of, of everything on your site. Wow, so Ruben, thank you. Hey, I'm going to put a note on that one. I'm going to give you some extra stuff. Uh, anyone who orders anything um, on our site, leave us, if you guys order it today, leave us a note on, on when you're checking out and I'll throw in some extra stuff. I'll throw in a, you know, heck, I'll throw in a whole heck. five pack of stickers right there for you. Just leave a note saying I was on your live stream. Well, we'll see as well, like the time. As what? Well. Like we can see what time they ordered. Right, so true. Like, within this time frame but please leave a note saying I, I i saw your live stream and i'll put up some extra stuff for you especially for you just because you guys are joining us i really love i really love having you guys here and being able to talk to you you at, at all the same time and the fact that we're like from all different corners of the world that's very special it's very special to me i want to say a big thank you to tight lines fishing Oh my $10. gosh, $10 donation. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like, oh my gosh. Thank you. And also to Be For Real 1964. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. You are so awesome. Like, we're just going to keep making this content, keep making these products, keep giving you things. Oh, let's talk about this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the deeper. Okay. So, we've been working with Deeper for what, like three years now? Probably since at least 2017, which was like when we first started the channel, basically. So it's been four years. So for those of you who don't know what a deeper is, it will basically, it's like this little ball, right? It's a very light ball that you can attach to your fishing rod line and you can cast it out and it'll tell you on your phone how deep the water is, the fish below, how cold the water is. And it'll start making a map for you to show you um, what that water looks like underwater. This thing is freaking awesome. Not going to exaggerate anything, but I use this thing every time I go to a new location and I need to know what the water is looking like under there. As soon as I find that channel or that deep drop off, I know I'm good to go. Yep. And much. It's, it's incredible. It's a really smart piece of technology because it takes a lot of the guesswork out. You know, when you're looking for certain underwater structure or even pods of fish or just being from shore and knowing I'm throwing into this. You would never know otherwise. You, it would take a lot of, of time to like figure really out where the drop-offs are and where fish are stacked. But I, I also think it's really great when, even if you do think you know the spot really well, you can take this deeper in here and check. Yeah. And then you'll really get a confirmation. Oh, oh I was actually right about this. Yeah, or, oh my true. gosh, this is way deeper than I thought. <laughs> it's a very, very great piece of technology to help you get, level up your fishing. Um, some people think it's just a matter of just throwing your, your bait into the water and hope for a fish. But, you know, that way works. But there are many, many little tips that you can do water and hope for a fish. But, you know, that way works. But there are many, many little tips that you can do, little things that you can do to increase the chances of catching a fish. Agreed. That's when you really get into fishing is you're able to figure out these little things put together are you're able to consistently get on fish. Yeah. Agreed. I want to say thank you to all these people who just donated to us because more oh my goodness. Jorin Jung from New Zealand. Thank you. Thank you. That's so amazing. Smoking, Smoking bass. Oh my goodness. Y'all are always here with us. I oh know. my gosh. Are you okay? What did we just do to deserve this? I don't know. We worked really hard. And Michael 
Didion. I hope Did that I'm saying that right. If you ever go to Texas, head up Matagorda Bay. I wanted to go there. Here the fishing is great, but never had the chance. Okay, I'm writing that down. I'll write it down. Write it down. I'll write it down. Laptop. Matagorda Bay. Anyone yeah. else who has suggestions for what we should do for the for the next upcoming trips, um, please give us the suggestions. We go wherever you guys tell us to go, um, but we need to hear from you guys. That's one of the most important parts about our channel is that that we have this communication with each other and we're creating content that you want to hear. Matagorda Bay looks awesome. It's not even Below the south of Houston. No, it's like above Galveston. Yeah, it's like around. No, okay. it's south of Galveston, but still. Wow. Cool. I'm about it. I'm saving it. I saved a lot of these. Brad things. some more gave us 20 bucks. He said, we're amazing. You're amazing. You're amazing. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you guys. We're here to give you guys stuff. I know. Stop really. giving us stuff. I'm getting so distracted. Really? We really, oh my gosh. How do you say this? Pe Pecho, Pecho, Pacheco, Pacheco, Pacheco. 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 Thank you. We hope one day we'll be able to fish with you in the Virginia, Virginia Maryland yes. area for unlimited bait. I can offer my help with your business. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a deal. <laughs> I think we might be able to meet up. We might be able to do some kind of fishing meetup in Maryland, Virginia area this year uh, for, for some white perch or something oh, like that. True. It would be fun. Really it would be fun. fun. And there will always be white perch around there, you know. So it'll be a good day of fishing. Yes, yes. Okay, and Clayton, oh my goodness. Clayton from Brazil. Fishing, Fishing is my, my passion, passion my and my life. life. I think that's a lot of people's passion yes. and a lot of people's lives. I agree. And for people who don't fish, they don't. They just don't understand. They don't understand. It's about more than fish, right? It's way more it's than like just about the actual fish you catch. It's the actual fish. It's the sustainability behind it. It's the, the being in nature, being able to connect yes. with your world in that way. It's just, it goes way more than just, I like fishing. You know, Christopher Olvera, thank you for the donation. Oh Jimmy for dinner is in Jupiter, Florida, and y'all would be in. Ooh, Florida. I didn't know he was in Jupiter. I didn't either. Okay, and Rich gave us five bucks for. Keep, he said, "Keep it up." Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much. We appreciate you. We love you. Come to Malibu. Let's go to Assateague. I will be there end of April. Let's go. Atlanta, Maybe. Georgia. Hello, D Johnson. <laughs> Cool. cool. Florida cool, Keys, cool. Channel 5 Bridge. Lots of awesome recommendations in here. Um, I, I'm just so happy just we have so go. much, so much different insight from different different places that like we can just keep making videos forever. Just keep <laughs> asking people what they want to see. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. okay. All right. Are you ready to talk about the rest of this? Oh my goodness. Jorge Ramos, thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Wow, wow, wow. Oh and my Tyler. gosh. Tyler, <laughs> you guys are crazy. I've never experienced oh my gosh. this. Tyler says, come to California, do a collab with Fisherman's Life. I would love to. He does some cool stuff. He catches like crabs and like all yeah, like, yeah, eating yeah. stuff. He does like a lot of catch and cook. That's like definitely a bucket list thing. I want to do some tide water fish, some yeah. some tide pool fishing with him. That would be really cool. Yes. Really cool. Yes. Two, true Somewhat, Ryan Schmidt says he can take us fishing in Louisiana. That sounds fun. Louisiana, Louisiana sounds Louisiana. awesome. I always like want to do Louisiana. It's like season like right now. I don't know how the fishing is. But hold on. True Patriot says, make more Hay Skipper ball caps. I want one so bad. <laughs> <We're>, <laughs> we've you. just continued those. But we had we did a, a short run of the, the, the Hay Skipper ball caps. Um, but now we've got the Hay Skipper beanies, which we have – only I think 30 left. So if you want one of these, you should get it before they're gone forever. Just yeah, like our, exactly our, what our ball caps are gone forever for now. So yep, yep. yep. Okay, yeah. so let's talk about grand prize. I'm ready for let's it. do the are grand prize. Are y'all ready for the grand prize? I'm ready. And honestly, I wish I could give everyone here a grand prize I and I could send everyone here something. I wish. Um, but we're gonna be giving as many of these away as we as we can. All you gotta do is just just um Sign up for our newsletter. We'll be telling you about more giveaways. We'll be telling you about more stuff uh, that we're going to be putting out. Uh, but let's just let's just get on with the, the winner. Let's it. hear it. I Everyone agree. wants to hear. Okay. We've been talking a lot. We talked a lot, but we've got this beautiful, beautiful. But we've got this beautiful, beautiful. Thing. He says we're doing. Thank you so much, D Johnson. Doing. Thank you. Okay. 
Aaron, let's let's pick the winner. All right, I'm ready for it. If you if I buy a beanie, can I get your autograph on a note, please? Yes. Absolutely. If you buy Thanks. anything from us and anybody wants an autograph, like a sticker, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I mean, it's flattering to me. I don't I don't really get asked to sign things, but of course <laughs> I'll sign it for you. Just leave me a note letting me know that you want it signed, and I'll sign anything you want me to sign. Agreed. Okay. Um, All right. So let's pick it. Wait, I didn't even oh. talk about what the rest of the prizes are. Okay. Is sorry. this deeper? This beautiful, gorgeous deeper. A hat. A hat. Sticker pack. And shrimpy starter kit. And special edition ultimate starter kit. A lot of bait. A lot of cool stuff. All right, go ahead and give me a drum roll. Drum roll, everyone! <laughs> Robert Shaw. Robert, Robert Shaw. Shaw. Robert Shaw. Robert, Robert Shaw. Shaw. Yes. Robert Shaw. Robert Shaw. Yes. Thank you, Robert Shaw. Well, I guess congratulations. Congrats, Robert everybody. Shaw. Thank is... you all for entering the giveaway. Thank you. Thank Don't you. worry. Thank you. This is not the only giveaway that we have. We have giveaways every single month, whether you know it or not. We don't put it, we don't always put it on YouTube though. We don't always put it on YouTube. We put it on onto our, our newsletter. So if you don't, if you're not signed up for our newsletter and you want to keep entering these things, uh, sign up for our newsletter. Yes. It, it's free. We don't spam with anything. Maybe we send one or two emails every week mm -hmm. about some either some kind of sale that we're doing, a new product. Yeah. Um, but we always announce when we have a new giveaway. So if you want to win the next giveaway. Uh, sign up for this newsletter and we'll do another one. I also just want to say, like, you guys are amazing. Everyone is so supportive in the chat saying congratulations. Like, just this community is so awesome, supportive. Like, I just, I love you we guys. Have the, we have the best community ever. Best I couldn't have asked for a better group of people here. I like, agree. you guys are so nice to each other. You're, you're nice to us. We're like, we're very, we're very, like, connected here all because of fishing and and we're from right. we're from all over right and honestly without naming you know names but i've seen for instance facebook groups right fishing facebook groups where like people are just kind mean. Of, like nasty they're just mean dramatic and mean yeah. you ask you ask a question and you get attacked by 10 of the members there that are like it's like whoa like that's so, not yeah, why i'm here exactly so the fact that this community is the way that it is like i'm so i'm just so proud yeah to like be part we're of gonna it, keep to it like guys. that we're gonna keep it like that too and i want to say thank you to rodrigo gill who says come to oregon in the next couple of months i'm gonna take you to fish for sturgeon Ooh, that sounds that's awesome that's on oregon that sounds awesome Your cousin's okay up there right okay so one last thing guys okay. what should we give away next what should we do for the next giveaway? Which is probably going to happen in a couple of weeks. So comment. Let's let's hear it. Let's hear it. What are some stuff that you guys are looking for, or you really want to win that you haven't you haven't just you haven't committed to buying yet, or you want to see someone use it first? Mm -hmm. What are some things that you want us to give away as a prize? Mm -hmm. And also remember, if you didn't, maybe you'll be contacted in a few days. Maybe someone won't claim their prize. Also, there are tons of right. other giveaways. Right. Also, we're giving away all these stickers if you're signing up for our People newsletter. People who don't claim their prizes within today, tomorrow, we're going to pick new, new winners. So it's not it's not the end yet. It's not over till the fat lady sings. William Rhodes. William Rhodes. Thank you. Thank you so oh, much. Oh, my goodness. You guys are my awesome. Goodness. And D Johnson, everyone who's okay, give away your starter kits, give away a fishing trip, a fish finder, another deeper, GoPro, GoPro, a GoPro, beach rod, a fishing rod, a custom combo, squiddy bits, rod and reel, fishing trip giveaway with you says Brad. Thank you. That Brad. might work out. That, that be would fun. be really cool. That, that but the thing is, what if the giveaway winner lives in like like Hawaii? How am I supposed to do that? Oh then? man, a trip to Hawaii that would just be so terrible. <laughs> okay that sounds great to me actually when you put it that way give away more bait more a bait okay finder, a trip with you okay also it says a lot of people say they want us to give away some more squiddy bits deeper gopro we could do a gopro we've done some yeah we can do a gopro in the past maybe that'll be the next big ticket thing is a gopro and like another starter kit we've done phoenix rod in the past yeah we've that done we've really gave fun. give away fishing rods um 
Yeah. Okay. Fishing rigs, beach rods, Stella reel. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. We could do this. We can do okay. this. Okay. I mean, given, given all your support that you guys give us, you know, this is the least that we can do is a giveaway every week. I know. Um, I love giving stuff away. I, so I that's actually it. another goal this year of ours is we sat down and came up with a bunch of um, yearly goals. What do we want? What are we going to be celebrating a year from now? Right. And we want to be giving as much as uh, giving away as much as we can this year. We want to be really putting out good vibes in this world. Yes. You know, it's not about taking, taking, taking. Something's got to give. The more you give, the more it comes back to you. And I feel like this in everything in life, not just fishing. You got to give to get. And it feels good to give. And even if it doesn't come back from that person, it's going to come back in the world in another form. And it's, it's just so important that, that we continue to have this attitude, not just with the fishing community. I'm talking about everything and just in life in general. You know, it's good to give. Yes. It's very good to give. And on that note, congratulations to our giveaway winners. We are going to contact you. We hope to hear back from you. Thank you all for being here, for, for being here every week, for supporting us, um, for giving us your love. We feel it. We hope to give it back. Um, it'll be, it'll be, I'm going to amplify it back and throw it right back at y'all guys. <laughs> Thank you so much for all the love. Uh, we really, really appreciate every single one of you yes. and, and just being here, talking with us, shooting, shooting the shit with us, giving <laughs> us ideas. Um, thank you guys so much. Yeah. Thank you. Have a great one, y'all. Sign off. Have a great week. It's Monday. Have a great week. Talk to you later. <laughs>